That's Margaret. She's an engineering major with, like, the highest GPA in the history of the school. But she lost her dog when everything went down, and she hasn't been the same since. Finding that dog will go a long way to helping her depression. Hey, whatever gets me that propeller. There's a dog park across the river that she always went to. I would check there first. Attention, player! You earn badges from playing with style. The more stylish you are, the more badges you will earn. When you earn enough badges, trade them in for overdrives. Overdrives give you boosts in your abilities. They're awesome! You can now unlock your first overdrive. Select the empty slot to equip a new overdrive. Want to unlock more overdrives? You gotta earn some badges first. You unlock and equip overdrives in the character page. Play how you want, and you'll get better at the things you enjoy. Nice! The dog park is over in Little Tokyo. You'll have to cross the North Bridge to get there. The bridge? No, I can just jump across on these boats. Wish there was a quicker way to get across the water. Timely. Thanks, text guy. Boats? Ugh, yikes. Open water scares me. It's just a river, Sam. The Bermuda Triangle. Hey! The Bermuda Triangle is no laughing matter. Hundreds of ships yeah. lost. Thousands claimed by the sea. Not only is it a hot and for tropical storms and magnetic anomalies, but I am pretty sure I read about alien abductions and leftover <laughs> technologies from Atlantis causing ultrasonic... Sam, I found the dog. You did? No, I just wanted to save the world from the rest of your story. <laughs> just call me when you find the dog. What's your name? Boo Boo? Come on, Boo Boo. Margaret's looking for you. What the fucking fuck? Hey, Sam, did you maybe forget some of the details about Margaret's robo dog? The thing won't follow me back. You must be in some kind of recovery mode. If it doesn't recognize the voice trying to command it, it will only interact with its favorite toy, Cutie Kitty. Listen, there's a toy store pretty close to you. Just try looking there for the kitty launcher, okay? Or you could just tell Margaret her dog is dead. That dog means a lot to her. Fine. Oh, wait, Sam. The dog is following me now. 
Oh, great! Oh no, it just committed suicide. Sorry, mission failed. What's next? Just check the toy store before giving up, okay? But giving up is my special move. That's my cutie kitty. Time to get incoming! Better work, Sam. And I better get my propeller. Don't worry. Just bring that back to the dog. Okay, dog, got something you might like. Please work, please. Ah, ah. Yeah, you like playing fetch? You want me to throw this thing for you? Ah. Hmm, how can I make this fun for me, too? How about... <laughs> Hell yeah. Hey, Sam, I got this stupid dog excited. Now, how do I reboot it? Not the best news to break to you, but Margaret has to do that here. <laughs> of course she does. Just try to get used to how he moves. You have a long trek back. Yeah, thanks for the reminder. So, while the dog's in recovery mode, he'll only go places he recognizes. Look, Margaret always walked Boo Boo over the North Bridge. Try luring him there. One other thing, you can't use your guns. The dog will sense you as a threat and kill you. Well, at least this will all be over. Don't worry, the dog will defend you as long as you have the cutie kitty. Try him out. It's actually pretty cool. <sighs> okay, dog. Sam says you're a killing machine. Let's see if you can kill some OD for me. Maybe I won't return this dog. Yeah, you're a good. All right, Pooch. Ah, not gonna lie, that was pretty cool. Let's do this, Pooch. Okay, where did Margaret walk the dog next? Hopefully, it's a place with more things to kill it. Down to the intersection, and then down the main street to Sasquatch and friends. Go get that the one who killed Daddy and took his cutie kitty. Gonna die, bitch. Ah, shit. Let's rock and roll, Pooch. Boy, Shark scam. Go get it. More scabs. Serious. Go get it. Close. Just get back to Sasquatch. Holy shit! Hey Sam, if I die protecting a fake dog, I'm gonna be pissed. Not sure who's protecting who at this point. Keep talking. I'm gonna shoot a cat on you. Just hurry. It's you and me, dog. Let's do this. <laughs>
Negotiate. I hope you get Robo Rabies. Maybe I won't return this dog. Thank you, Sam. You're the best. Sure. Anytime. Yeah, really nice work, Sam. Okay, we need to convince just one more person to help. Then we can start building your propeller. Max is the math whiz at Oxford West. If anyone can calculate a propeller for optimal lift, it's him. I think he's worried about his parents. Maybe you could go check on them. The most incredible news. Max's parents live in the penthouse suite of the tallest tower. Those Fizco execs make a lot of money, you know. Well, there might be a product recall on their latest drink. I'm just saying, I'm sure that can't help the stock price. You'd think, right? But nobody on the outside knows yet. Most of their stockholders probably think everything is running smoothly. With perhaps the exception of Max's parents. Correct. They're probably dead. But there is a chance they made it into their panic room. Oh, of course they have a panic room. I had an entire panic apartment. It just looked like my normal apartment, but with boarded up windows and me inside, panicking. Isn't there a chance Max's parents turned into OD when everybody else did? It's possible. Be careful when you open that panic room door. <laughs> yeah, I'm here at the fancy town tower. You could have given me a heads up that this place was crawling with scabs. How would I know? I'm practically a shut-in after Horror Night. Although, it makes sense. Once you secure the bottom floor, you have all that living space above you. If only I could find a... This'll work. Thank you very much.
Scab, your fiery, explosive ragdoll death used my senses. Yep. Ah, that barricade doesn't look too solid. That's scab ingenuity for you. I'm sure, I can bring it down somehow. for not making me start at the bottom. in the Gymkata remake. You know what building climbers need? Oxygen! Guess what? Overcharge has carbon dioxide bubbles! Dioxide means what? twice as much oxygen! Puzzling puzzle. Hey, you're killing a lot of people. Don't worry, I won't tell. As long as you drink some overcharge. <laughs> Thank you. 
panic room here. Just be on the taller tower. This makes perfect. Let's try again. Gotta get over to the taller tower. Hey, I just talked to your doctor. Bad news, you're gonna die. <laughs> Unless you drink some overcharge right now. Hey, scabs, I'm coming for you. to check the panic room. Please don't make me find some weird sex stuff. <laughs> Voice recorder. Max's parents dying words? Let's find out. Security breached. Oh, shit. Get all the loot! Yep. Gotta listen to that voice recording before I head back. Max needs to know what happened to his parents. Found it! Max, if you're hearing this message, then it means you're still alive. Yes. Shame. Your mother and I are going to live in the Bahamas, where cashing out your trust fund so mommy can drink a lot of champagne and daddy doesn't have to get a new job. Anyway, best of luck. Yep. By the way, have you tried drinking our new overcharged drink yet? I think you'd like it. Well, at least the dick bag left a message. Max is now poor and an orphan. We should probably just tell him his parents were skeletons in a bathtub. Just get back. We'll figure out the least worst thing to tell him. So, Sam, you're sure your friends are going to listen to you now? Sure, I'm sure. Thanks to you, they think I did all this great stuff for them. You're sort of a modern-day Cyrano de Bergerac. I have no idea what that means. Well, of course I'm referencing the play, not the real Cyrano. Whatever. I'll be whoever you need me to be, as long as I get that propeller. Well, his parents are still alive, but they're major assholes. He stole his money and left him for dead. Yeah. I'll break the news. Yes! Freedom! Thanks, Sam. Best news ever! So, Sam, you expect us to believe you went out and did all this stuff by yourself? I think you had a little help. Who gives a shit what you think? You guys just sit on your asses all day while this hero goes out into the city, all to get you a bunch of useless shit so you can be happy. I don't know about you, but that inspires me. Makes me want to be a hero to this hero. I know we can do it. Together. We're gonna have to work hard.
Now, Sam forgot one thing. If you don't help him, I'll throw your ass out on the street to fend for yourself. I'm on board with this. Hey, let's get to work. Cool speech. I'm ready. What is it? It's a 3D printer. It's gonna make you a new propeller. Oh, cool. Yeah, I know. Mm, but it needs a faster processor. Of course it does. <sighs> I'll see what I can find. I have real beauty. Freedom. I'm just like free. I have brilliant new design. Have you been taking fashion advice from Two Hat Jack? Whatever look you're going for, you missed. What interesting mittens. 